Nicole, today has finally arrived. The day I get to call you my wife and my life partner. It's so hard to believe that we are finally here. I'd like to start off by thanking you for making me go to prom all those years ago. Even though I went alone, I came out with my forever person. Now loving you has been the easiest thing for me to do, and the first time I saw you, I knew I had to make you mine. I never thought I would fall for you as quickly as I did, but it was the best thing that has ever happened to me. I like to think God made us for each other, like Ross and Rachel. No matter what happened in our relationship, we never gave up on each other. I can easily say I vow to always listen and communicate with you, even if I think I'm right. I vow to always compromise with you. I promise to never give up on you. I vow to be your welcoming smile on a stressful day and to be your loving hug. I vow to lift you up when you are down. I promise to protect and cherish you. I vow to be your light at the end of the tunnel. I promise to binge watch Friends and America's Next Top Model with you. I vow to make you laugh every day. I promise to be your best friend as well as your biggest fan. I vow to be the man you deserve each and every day. I commit to be yours only forever and always. I promise to love you until I can't possibly love you anymore. I vow to be your yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Lloyd, as we stand here today in front of our family and friends, I'm so honored. Honored to be marrying such an amazing man like you and to finally be joining your family. I'm so excited to be starting this journey and new chapter of life together. Seven years ago, I would have never believed we would be here today. I've watched you grow into a patient, generous, and hardworking man. I'm inspired daily by the way you love me and love others and have always put your family first. You have also helped shape me into the woman that I am today. You've taught me to worry less about the small things and to always chase my dreams. I know without a shadow of doubt that I am marrying the person God made for me. I believe he shaped us for one another before we ever met. You came into my life at the perfect time, a time when you didn't need to take on all that comes with me, but God knew that I needed you. Since the first time we met, your pursuit of me has been consistent and relentless. You've never made me question the way you feel for me. You have always been there with a hand to hold, offering words of encouragement and always ready with a famous Lloyd hug. I hope to always be a sense of comfort because that's what you have done for me. Seven years together so far, and one thing I know for sure is, loving you is second nature, and I'm going to do it for the rest of my life, because falling for you wasn't falling at all. It was like walking into a house and knowing that you're home. At 15, your blonde curly hair and accurate RSX Rexy caught my eye. You fit the description of my perfect guy, but little did I know you would reveal so many wonderful traits I didn't even know to look for. I love the way you dream big. I love the smile you get when you tell me all about a new superhero movie. And I love your kind soul and tender heart. The way you love and care for Molly, I know you'll be the best father someday. I love that you are so committed to our relationship and care about growing and nurturing it. We have always been your first priority and for that I am so thankful. You have always been my greatest adventure and I am certain this adventure will only get sweeter after today. I realize that marriage is a commitment to God and to you. So as I marry you today, I commit myself to loving you and choosing you daily, seeing you with patient and forgiving eyes. I vow to have listening ears when you don't feel heard. I vow to laugh with you on the good days and to support you on the bad. I vow to embrace whatever our situation in life is and walk through it by your side. To give grace as Christ does and to always be a safe place for you to land. I vow to fill our home with love, laughter, and babies, and to be the best best mother that I can be. I vow to hug you every day when we get home and to slow dance in the kitchen. I'll work on my shoe shopping and accepting that you won't always check the bag for extra ranch. I understand that things won't be perfect, but as long as we're together, Hidden Valley will do in a pinch. And lastly, I vow to pray for you and with you, and I commit myself to looking toward God and pointing you in his direction, helping you follow him as you lead our household. Today, I take you as my husband. You are the one I will laugh with daily, wake up to, and trust with all my secrets. Your blonde hair and infectious laugh is what I want our children to have. You're my very best friend, better half, and the one I want to binge watch friends with. As Phoebe would say, he's her lobster and you are mine. 
I promise to love you till we're old and gray and even longer. Watch the ocean kill 